Ah, loot crate. What can I tell you about loot crate? Uh, this box, which I think was January's box, um, it was on a special where you could have, I think it was 30% off, um, and you'd get some free, uh, some free Deadpool slippers. I missed the slippers, I put the code in, um, and they charged me the full price, they charged me the full £24. However, I did send an email to Loot Crate, and they actually gave me a refund, um, something which I know that they don't normally do, and even on the email, they said, we don't normally do this, but because of the, the error with the discount code, um, they refunded £17.50, which means that this box cost a grand total of £16.50, I think. Uh, so this box is normally £24 a month, so we've got the £7.50 off. So yes, this was £16.50. Now, I think this has Rick and Morty in it. I'm not 100% sure. I think this is why I got the box, because I've got a friend of mine um, who is really into Rick and Morty stuff, and has said if I see any of those sorts of bits out in the uh, car boots, to basically pick them up and he will buy them off me. So, without further ado, let's uh, open it up, shall we? So, when you open a box, this is what you're going to see. Oh, is that going to be a Rick and Morty t-shirt? Okay. It is a Rick and Morty t-shirt. That's annoying. Oh, I do like it, though. So, Rick and Morty t-shirt. It's worth about £10. That's kind of cool. I like that. I'm just annoyed that they advertise Rick and Morty in the box and it is only the t-shirt. But we also have Harry Potter and Westworld. So our Harry Potter item is a pair of Harry Potter socks and I won't be keeping these. Um, I, have a, uh, I have a feeling it's going to be my other half. Um, she, she will be having them. But you see we've got the sorting hat and you've got the, uh, the emblems from each of the houses. A uh, Hufflepuff Gryffindor, Slytherin, uh, and Ravenclaw, I think. The pin is, I like that. It's the maze from Westworld, which of course um, returns in the spring of this year. Um, looking forward to that. That was one of the surprises of last year. Um, absolutely fantastic. And our main Westworld item is... It's Dolores and Arnold. Now, it's Dolores holding a gun by the looks of it. Controversial. Just cut into the box. Absolute noob. 17 plus. Don't know why it's 17. Okay, I've got to put it together. be honest I don't know what the hell is going on here because I've got holes that aren't holes you can see just there I've got holes that aren't holes in Dolores I mean she will stand Poor old Arnold, he hasn't got a leg to stand on. I don't know if you guys can quite pick it up, but... I made him stick anyway. So Dolores will just stand there. And it looks a little something like this. If I can turn it very gently. Which, you know what, I do like it just killed Dolores but yes Westworld does return this year and we have our oh, X-Files as well the X-Files stuff that they always send out is absolutely terrible this is just going to be a card holder isn't it oh I kind of like it I kind of like it 
what are these? Well, some sort of cards inside. Got absolutely no idea. Um, hmm. Strange one. I don't. I don't know what to make of this. It is Loot Crate exclusive. When it focuses, focus, focus. Perfect. It's not going to focus, but that is a Loot Crate symbol in the center. Um, I mean, the twenty-four pounds of value is there. Um, I'm not going to give the T-shirt ten pound anymore. Um, it's going to have to be eight. Uh, I think from here on in, the T-shirts are going to have to start dropping in price because it is just a regular print, to be fair. Uh, then, oh, okay. Exclusive Rick and Morty T-shirt, licensed by Cartoon Network, art by Anthony Petri. Exclusive Westworld Super Emo Scenes, diorama figure, licensed by Warner Bros, made by Loot Crate. Exclusive Harry Potter socks, licensed by Warner Bros., made by HYP Hosiery. Uh, exclusive x Wilds card game. It is actually a card game. I might have to see what that is all about. Uh, licensed by 20th Century Fox, made by IDW Publishing. Exclusive worldwide, worldwide? Westworld maze pin, uh, licensed by Warner Bros, made by Loot Crate. Um, visit magazine.lootcrate.com for full product details, loot community features, and more. Um, the value is definitely there. However, I've had better crates. Um, mm. ah, see, I do like the Westworld stuff, but I collect too much stuff as it is. Can you not tell there's too much behind me? Uh, socks, going to the missus. T-shirt, I'll be keeping. The, the Westworld bits, I'm tempted to get rid of. And then, I don't know, we're going to do some sort of a giveaway. Uh, we'll sort of something out. I'm still trying to work out what I'm going to do, but it's going to be like a, a, a goodies box, I think. That's what I'm leaning to anyway. But, I do like that pin. As I was saying, that is all from me. As always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Good gaming and happy collecting. Adios.